Hello, welcome to this month's Steam Shop Update. I'm here with Austin Barker, Foreman General of the Steam Program, and we're inside the firebox and combustion chamber on the big boy. We're going to talk about the boiler work that we've been working very hard on. Uh, I've got my left hand up here on what we call the rear tube sheet, or the combustion chamber side of all the tubes and flues on the big boy locomotive. These were massive locomotives and they burned around 28 tons of coal every three to four hours when they were producing their maximum power. And the coal, of course, burns down to a cinder and it really does do a number on the metal plates and sheets in here. You can see up here, all of this firebox stay bolts have small little steel eyebrows that are welded there as a means of protecting them from that tremendous erosion effect of the cinders. And here to talk about the actual work of fitting up the firebox plate and installing everything is Austin Barker. Well, you can see behind us, we fit up the, the rear tube sheet and uh, it's 9 16 plate. And it was formed, flanged actually, to make this knuckle. And we used what was called a McCabe flanger. A, uh, a railroad contractor did that for us around the edges. And then we, we made a die to form the top edge because it goes from three quarter inch radius up to a two inch radius and back down to three quarter inch radius. And to do that with a McCabe would have required a, a number of different dies. So we just made one big die and hot flanged that. Above that, you can see the, the half inch plate for the crown sheet and the, the bottom combustion chamber uh, replacement sheets down here. And that represents quite a bit of welding and fit up uh, that we did here in the shop pretty proud of what the guys did here. Yeah, very good. A tremendous fit up when you're working to fit these sheets up, it requires that both plates are beveled to take the weld necessary for these high pressure steam locomotive type patch welding. So it's just a tremendous process, all code material, and now we're going to start the process of installing nearly 500 different types of stay bolts inside this firebox to finish this big milestone on this big project. We thank you very much for watching and we really sincerely appreciate all your support. Thank you.